Colleen ISD parents are outraged after their kids were told to do an assignment filled with racial slurs and offensive words. The teacher who created the assignment was removed from the school district, but parents are still not understanding how this happened. Six News reporter Adriana Alexander has more on how it happened and the district's response. I'm here at Rancier Middle School in Colleen, where a seventh grade classroom was assigned to unscramble insensitive and offensive words and then make sentences out of them. Now parents are furious and want to know why this teacher was able to do this and how this was able to happen. A seventh grade student took their classroom assignment from Rancier Middle School to their after school program. An employee noticed the vulgar content on the pages, contacted parents who then immediately notified the district. The worksheet included the words fat, stupid, idiot, ugly, and many other offensive words that we cannot display on television. Not long after KISD was made aware of the assignment, Superintendent Dr. John Kraft sent a letter to parents and staff. It reads in part, the assignment does not align with the core values of the district and the district deeply regrets the assignment was ever created. He also said the teacher no longer worked for the district. KISD parent Brianna Green says she's now lost trust in what the district is teaching her kids and firing the teacher was not enough. What if this whole incident would have triggered a student to act out or, to, you know, there's so many factors. So just firing a teacher, I'm sorry, the district has to be responsible. This was the teacher's first time ever teaching at Colleen ISD. At six, hear more from the superintendent as he shares how the district is making sure that this never happens again. In Colleen, Adriana Alexander, Six News. Adriana, thank you. Dr. Kraft said the district will continue to investigate and interview all people who may have had knowledge of this issue. Of course, you can read all about the assignment. Uh, also, we'll have any updates on the story at our website, kcntv.com.